What's up, YouTube? Jeff, your style OG. And on today's video, we're gonna talk about the 10 biggest summer style mistakes. If you're new to the channel, we release a new video every day at 4 p.m. Eastern, discussing various men's lifestyle topics, such as style, grooming, and dating. I invite you to subscribe and tap that notification bell and join us. And to my returning friends like Paul McCartney, salute. Now hands down, summer is one of the hardest seasons to dress for. Less clothes leads to less options and also more readily making mistakes. But with today's video, I'm gonna highlight 10 of the summer style mistakes we make and how you can avoid them. So without further ado, let me help you look a little more stylish in the summer and avoid those top warm weather mistakes. First up, we gotta talk about one of my pet peeves. You guys out there that like to wear flip-flops away from the beach. There is a such thing as too casual, and flip-flops are just that. Now, I'm not saying you can't wear sandals. A nice sandal is cool. However, the problem with that, most of us guys, our feet aren't the best to look at. If you're gonna wear sandals, make sure you have the pedicure. But please, whatever you do, no flip-flops away from the beach. For our next summer style mistake, we're staying in the shoe area. But this one kinda is functional. Don't go sockless in the summer. Now I know it's tempting to have a nice streamlined, cool look, but no socks leads to funky feet and damaged shoes from the moisture getting into your leather. Of course, there is a solution that gives you the sockless look without going without socks. Whatever you do, rock some no-show socks. No-show socks, one of the best investments you can make during the warm weather. Wear them with your loafers, wear them with your boat shoes. Get that sockless look without actually going sockless. Speaking of staying cool in the summer, the next mistake on our list is the fact that a lot of guys avoid wearing undershirts. Now with the extra heat and all the sweating we're gonna do, one of the bad results of that, that sweat pitting and stains. An undershirt helps form a protective barrier between you and your clothes, hiding those sweat stains. Helps protect you from being embarrassed from showing that sweat, and it protects your shirt and helps them last long. So you definitely wanna invest in undershirts. Next up on our list of mistakes, wearing the wrong sunglasses. And when I talk about the wrong sunglasses, I'm mainly talking about two areas. One, wearing the wrong sunglasses for the shape of your face, and two, wearing the wrong type of sunglasses. Now every type of sunglass doesn't work for every shape of your face. As a matter of fact, I've got a video on how to pick the right sunglasses for the shape of your face right here. Check that one out. And secondly, the style mistake guys make when picking sunglasses in the summer, wearing sport sunglasses. Now these are appropriate and very limited athletic type endeavors. But if you're trying to look stylish, there's way better styles to pick up, such as aviators, wayfarers, you name it. Please stay away from the sports sunglasses. Now staying stylish in the summer, or any season for that matter, doesn't just mean wearing the right clothes. It's also making sure you pay attention to your grooming. Because we're wearing less and less clothing, the details stand out, and your grooming and hygiene an important detail. One of the key things you definitely want to pay attention to Get that back hair. You gotta get that manscaping done. When you're wearing less clothing, the grooming and the hygiene mistakes stand out even more. Next up on the list, I want you to avoid wearing shorts that don't fit, but especially shorts that are too big. Now, I recently did a video on how shorts should fit that you can definitely check out in the description, but to summarize the most important parts, you wanna wear shorts that fall a little bit above your knee and follow the tapering shape of your leg. Anything bigger than that, just doesn't look right, gonna swallow you up. So make sure you wear the right shorts that fit you. Now, of course, I gotta piggyback on the last one. Please, whatever you do, no cargo shorts. Those are just the wrong shorts. They're juvenile and just not stylish. The extra pockets, you really don't need them. Please, no cargo shorts. Instead, opt for a pair of Chino flat front shorts. They're much more flattering. The cargo shorts, gotta go. Next up on our list, relying too much in the warmer months on darker t-shirts. Now I love a nice black t-shirt like the next guy. Only problem, they show sweat much easier. Your lighter colored t-shirts, especially your white, that sweat won't show as easily. So if you're a little bit of a heavier sweater like me, opt for lighter colored t-shirts during the summer. And last but certainly not least on my list of the worst style mistakes we make during the summer, wearing the wrong cologne. Now of course I'm a big proponent of wearing scents. The sense of smell, the ladies love it but you wanna wear the appropriate cologne for the summer. During the colder months, those woody, stronger, earthier, muskier scents work well, but they're just not appropriate for the warmer weather. 
You want lighter, cleaner, fresher notes. Think citruses, think your lavenders, things of that nature. You want light scents that go with the warmer weather. So please don't make the mistake of not switching out those darker, heavier colognes for your lighter ones during the summer. Okay, so there you have it. My list of the top 10 style mistakes we make during the summer. Let me know in the comment section if you can think of some summer style mistakes guys make. As always, I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, hit that like button. It helps the channel to grow. And of course, tap that notification bell so you don't miss any of the videos we release every day at 4 p.m. Eastern. And I'll check you out tomorrow.